Okay, folks, I got this at an op shop months ago before the things, before the cost of living started to ramp up high and that I fucking can't look after, can't keep going with the budget. So now I'm stopped going to op shops altogether to buy my materials to source them. I just basically now find things on the street most of the time or reuse my magazines instead of buying new ones and focusing on instead of focusing on the cover of the magazine I do other parts because I was doing primarily just covers and it's just too expensive doing it that way it's a bit wasteful as well so I'm trying to be more resourceful I found some really good clothing items by the side of the road someone put a, a handwritten word note saying free so these I took I, one of them's got sequins which is really nice it's like a, the kind of stuff you'd find in an op shop instead of on the street anyway let's see what this op shop acquisition is it is it's a tarnished it's a tarnished um, cup silver silver you see the lovely colors and patterns on there I'm just interested in primarily there's a part I'm interested in that bit there that hot colors like there's colors like yellow and red and all that sort of stuff I'm going to try and focus on that I'm going to try and roll it across there like so which is challenging This is highly experimental, folks. Extremely difficult. Yeah, this is shit. I knew it would come up shit, actually. Didn't get much on there. We just got something there, a smudge or something. I don't know, folks. I'm going to try and put that piece back in the frame. There goes a fucking window chewing cockatoo. They love chewing windows and fly screens and fucking things up because they get fed by us stupid humans. Or some of us, not all of us. I don't feed the shitters. Just use my camera hand there. I think 400% is too big for this because it's just too fast. And that's come up interesting, just a flash of blue, and that's it. Interesting, but not what I want. Not what I want, folks. <coughs> Maybe I'll lessen the horizontal enlargement. I might photocopy the dots. I might focus on the dots. They might be something to look at. I might put that on 200 as well. Yeah, that's come up looking interesting. You can just see a couple of the dots, but not enough to convince me that it's a good run. <sighs> Fuck, I hate these bloody difficult ones, folks. I do set myself some really difficult targets when it comes to photocopying things artistically. I really do set myself some real difficult marks, so to speak. <clears throat> yeah that's come up looking interesting you can see some of the the speckles on the page it looks quite promising bit of a tease really when you consider I'm trying to make this into something really nice
It's like trying to catch the wave, the so-called perfect wave as a surfer. And that's come up looking quite nice, actually. I do think maybe we can do it again. Or maybe we can work with it. We can perhaps take a section out of it and enlarge it just to get those lovely dots. Even though I still feel I could do it better. I don't know how that's going to look. <clears throat> I still feel I could do it better, um, even though it's really difficult, folks. Can't fucking fit it in. I actually think maybe we'll go back to the drawing board maybe not <clears throat> maybe this is as good as it gets i've got to fold the page because it's not going to fucking line up at the top so just bear with me folks as i try to fold this piece of paper nicely as i can sorry about the, the bad camera work i'm doing i just had to fold it so it doesn't bash against the edge there Because you can't put it there if it's up against the edge of this dock feeder. shit house actually I think we've lost a lot of the good stuff of this I do think um, I think the verticals too high on the enlargement like catching a wave <laughs> even the photocopier sometimes sounds like a wave at the beach I haven't been to the beach for a long time but I used to go a lot in my early early teens with my family when we used to be before my dad broke up with my mum we used oh, and before he started working overseas uh, we were all as a family we used to go to the beach um, Yeah, I really miss the beach sometimes, folks. Um, I'd like to go to the beach when I get married to my partner, Luigi. If I can get on the 6 o'clock news on Channel 9, that'll get me there and I'll be able to get in touch with Luigi and we can go together. And I don't have to worry about not having a place to lock up my keys and my purse and my wallet and shit because I can't do that on my own. I can't just leave it on the beach while I'm out surfing, or body surfing, or boogie boarding as I like to boogie board. Um, I don't know if I like it. I do think maybe that could move across. I do like it overall. Um, I actually think I might do something different to it to make it nicer. I'm going to reverse the colours. I don't know how that's going to work with this.
Yeah, that's come up looking quite interesting. I don't know which one's better. It looks a bit yucky, the colour there, but it looks interesting. Maybe I could do a hue, hue adjustment to this. I do like the overall look of the colour and that. getting hot now folks. The thing I hate about this hot weather for this year is that because my the cost of living is going up sharply including the especially the electricity I can't afford to take a shower every night or even every second night so I have to take a shower once a week in order to make the balance the bank the um, budget balance <coughs> and I really hate it folks. I really wish the 6 o'clock news channel 9 would air my material because I'm trying to get in touch with a lost partner as well and it's really I'm drowning in fucking expenses and I'm going to end up I can't afford to pay for the bank loan on this photocopier I can't afford to pay my power bill I can't afford to pay this I can't afford to um, have my telcos I keep going broke all the time. The only reason why I haven't gone broke is because my mother gave me some Christmas money and birthday money, but that's not enough to last compared with all the expenses. Bless my mum. She's a beautiful woman. She's had a hard life. Don't know why she married my fucktard father. <coughs> Sorry, my throat. I've got something in my throat. It's just irritating me. Sorry, folks, enough is enough. Whew. But, yeah, it's getting expensive. The costs of living are going up while, while my disability support pension and my uh, wage at the Australian Disability Enterprise... Or ADE is my employment. Well, that's not keeping pace either. It's like nothing's keeping pace except the inflation itself. And I haven't got that sort of money to deal with that. So I'm really disappointed with the way things have turned out that I haven't found my partner. And I've been working on this campaign for more than a decade. Lots of hard work and all that has gone, has gone into it an expense. And now that's come up looking uh, quite a treat. I think we can now call this demo quits.